did it then, sure knew his stuff. I felt real lucky he was my lieutenant. He was from a long, great military tradition. Somebody in his family had fought and died in every single American war. General Fund reporting for duty. Today we are looking at the Lieutenant Dan Bloodbath Rules Map 2.0. I just had this printed at the print shop. Kind of a long process. Uh, took almost two weeks, but we got it done. Uh, what makes this map special is that every battle of World War II is marked on this map, which is just amazing. Um, it's Bloodbath Rules 2.0 compliant, so it has the Trans-Siberian Railroad. We have the Kaluth, Kaloon Mountain um, block there, Himalayan Mountains there, and we also have the um, some of the uh, victory point icons, the uh, oil icons, oil derricks, and some of the resource icons are marked on the map. Um, one thing that I did um, that I, I wanted on this map that wasn't there, so I went ahead and did with the Corporal Clegg uh, sticker paper, is that I uh, printed out the um, industrial complex and also the um, Air base and naval base icons just for ease of setup. So there it is. This is the Lieutenant Dan Bloodbath Map 2.0 and all its uh, beautiful color and glory. And um, look forward to using this in uh, upcoming games and and for years to come. Okay, as a second part um, of the new uh, Bloodbath Rules Lieutenant Dan map, I also had the new Bloodbath Rules 2.0 rule book uh, printed at Ye Old Print Shop. This is another one that falls under customizations expensive, but it is a beautiful, beautiful rule book. Love it. Highly recommend it. Um, I would just say, for what I paid to have this printed, it it makes it probably makes more sense just to um, purchase the map straight up off of uh, or map the book off of Sire Blood straight up. That's um, in retrospect, that's what I should have done. But I was already having the map made, so I went ahead and did this too. But anyway, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to General Fund for less dishonor.